The primaries were only yesterday, but chairman of the Allen County Democratic Party, Derek Camp, and Allen County GOP chairman, Steve Shine, haven't shied away from voicing their confidence for November. After Tuesday's primary elections, there was plenty of celebrating for Democrats and Republicans who are confident they'll expand their majority in city council. The Democrats will not take over. We have great district candidates running uh, in the first, second, third, and fourth, and our at-large candidates are all superstars. Steve Shine is the chairman for the Allen County Republican Party. He says their party registered 7,000 more votes this primary election than the Democrats. One reason he's sure Republicans will keep their majority on city council. He will help us all stay in check. I think that I am probably uh, more excited about the municipal election uh, for the Democrats to uh, fall short in 2023 uh, than I have been in, in many years. While the Republican Party in Allen County seems certain. I don't know what he is so confident about. Democrats like Allen County Chair Derek Camp aren't sure why. The Republicans have the right to be confident as they've held majority on city council for three decades. This success going that you, that you... But Democrats believe that streak will end in November and they already have their eyes on certain seats. I think the strongest ones are, are very obviously the second and the fourth city council districts. In each of those districts, we are looking at previous election results that are extremely competitive, extremely close. Despite Republicans registering more votes, Camp says the percentage of votes cast for Democrats this primary increased roughly 10 percent from four years ago. He also says this year showed a decline in Republican voters. Because of that, Camp says the possibility of holding the mayor's office and a city council majority has increased in their eyes dramatically. Uh, I don't think it's a dream. It is obviously something we want, but it is something that is very much in the realm of possible this year, and we are doing everything we can to make that a reality. We have flipped seats with greater odds in the past, and we're going to do it even now. For 21 Alive News, I'm Alex Knoll.